Hey guys, what's up? Iconic Games Slinger here, back in another Starbound video with my crew. Um, <laughs> cause uh, cause they're they're all AIs. <laughs> um, but anyways, what do you call it? So last time, I think I went cave exploring, if I'm not mistaken, right? And then I <laughs> I discovered that I can paint stuff. Um, but anyways. So we're back. Um, I finally, off camera, I beat Dreadwig. Um, but I'll also defeat him on camera, just, just so, uh, <clears throat> proof. Uh, <laughs> but anyways, uh, I also, I decided to go mining, as I said, uh, probably last video, and I upgraded my furnace. Pr what was it called? A primitive furnace? Fre? A uh, furnace. Okay. Yeah, but I upgraded it into an industrial furnace. So now I'm able to make durasteel bars. Hopefully I'm not saying that wrong. And, um, titanium bars. Uh, which I do not <laughs> know how to get yet. Um, <laughs> so I guess we'll put that off. But anyways, um, I finally defeated him. As you can also see, I added uh, a new space because I got more weapons. <laughs> Um, then I need, as also you can see in my inventory, um, oh, you know what, uh, you know that upgrade thing, uh, at the outpost, uh, I was finally able to get a Lunarang, which is what I was trying to get, which is, here, let me just quickly show you, it's basically like, um, it's not basically, it is, um, another version of the Boomerang. Which I got two, what do you call it? One, I don't know if I got, one of them I know I probably got on camera, question mark? And then the other, I think I got off camera from just exploring. And now I have a Lunar Ring, which took me 15 phase matter. <laughs> and one of the upgrade modules to get. And it's actually really, it, it's okay. I mean, it's not the best, but it's pretty good. Cause um, when it hits a block, it splits into four um, little boomerangs or lunarangs. Um, plus it goes a farther distance, which is good. Um, but yeah, just wanted to show off a little few of my new weapons. Oh yeah, and I also got this, which is basically <laughs> the same thing or the same gun um, but I think of a different element. It also has a different name, but the second name is the same. And I noticed they looked the same, so I'm just assuming that they're pretty much the same. <laughs> um, but look at this. Now I can like shoot a lot of uh, a lot of bullets at the same time, which is how I was able to beat uh, Dreadwing. Anyways, enough talking. Let's go fight Dreadwing. Um, hold up. Let me just quickly equip my... I don't... When did I get this? I forgot when I got this, but it was... <laughs> I think it was on camera. And I realized how OP this is. Because it has mark shot. Which, uh, basically, it marks your opponent. And when you shoot... Uh, if you mark multiple opponents, the, the bullet will bounce off. Look, look at this. So, let's just say I get two, uh, we can get the third one, right? Let's say I get three of these, and I shoot this one. D I, I missed. <laughs> um, okay, let me try that again. And I said if I shoot this one. Did I, I actually missed that a second time. And they were standing still. Okay. Just, there you go. It just bounces off of the enemy. Which I thought was really cool. Um, oh, and you might also notice that I have, I now have, um, I switched my weapon, or not my weapon, my jump ability to three jumps, three mini jumps, which I was able to do using the cards that I got from exploring. Okay, hold up. Uh, can I hit? I should be able to hit all- Wait, one of them wasn't even an enemy. I think that was a bunny. <laughs> oh no! Okay, well then. I missed my shot. Okay, you're not in the same Yeah, but I really like dual wielding these two guns because they just shoot so fast. Look at this. Like, what? 
Uh, okay. Hold up. I need a backup. Because, uh... <laughs> there's some enemies here. Okay, I'm gonna shoot this one. There you go. And we're gonna mark him again. There you go. Okay. They should be gone. Uh, okay, before fighting Dreadwig, which is, is about to come up, right? Because he's gonna appear somewhere here. I am going to quickly heal up in the tent. Um, but yeah, I realized <laughs> that I might be able to do it with just these two guns. Um, even though they're like really weak in damage, they do some pretty good, um, wait, hold up, rate of fire, okay, so this one shoots faster, and this one takes more energy, though, uh, but yeah, oh my goodness, I'm able to rapid fire so quickly, it's amazing, um, I feel like, though, they don't have too much accuracy, so... I would assume it would be better on using bigger, or using them on bigger opponents. I don't know why, but my English is like really bad <laughs> right now. Hold up. Um, but anyways, hold up. Let me see if I can spot, uh, spot a dude. Okay, we need to eliminate a few of these guys before we start mm -hmm. fighting Dreadwig. Alright, I'm ready. So, start shooting at him. Um, so, uh, <laughs> I read a little strategy guide for how to beat him. I don't- I didn't actually follow the strategy guide that well. But I- I am using like one thing from it, which is um... Trying my best not to go- what do you call it? Go after the tank? Uh, okay. Yeah, but when it's- when he starts spawning his minions, there's not really a point where- uh, I mean, there's no point in trying to keep track where your location is. Because then, the minions shoot you anyways, so you're just gonna have to dodge it. Um, okay. But yeah, so what I do is, I just keep running back and forth. Trying to make sure his minions don't hit me. Which is, oh my goodness, okay. Which is a little bit difficult. <laughs> Not too difficult, though. Okay, never mind. Hold up. Where'd he go? Yeah, but when I run out of room, I just have to dodge over them! Okay, that's a lot of damage. Oh, no. Okay, I got a little bit of damage. Uh, I actually... Okay, so I'm actually slightly confused what those things are. Oh, no, I need to heal. Okay. What those... The little saucers that are going under Dreadwig? I have no idea what those are. I'm, I'm assuming they're like little him, little hymns, that's not a word, him is not a word, <laughs> little, I mean hymns, uh, with an S, uh, okay, hold up, I need to keep dodging, okay, make sure I don't get hit by these rockets, okay, I need to heal, I need to heal, oh my goodness, there you go, okay, he's dead, this is it, Dreadwig, Oh my goodness, okay, second time beating him! No, 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 no! I do not want to die to one of his minions, because that would be sad. After I literally beat him. Like, once, I was, um, if, on my attempt off camera, literally he was super close to dying. And the last moment, a bullet hit me out of nowhere. And I died because I forgot to heal. And I was like, no, what? Uh, but then my, my next attempt was a success, so I mean. Because <laughs> I learned I can beat him. <laughs> okay, cool. Um, now we have a second book. For the Dreadwig thing. I already, I didn't hear away. I'll read it on camera. Or not read it, uh, because my reading's pretty bad. <laughs> But uh, here you go. So, gather ye around and hear tell of Dreadwig, scourge of the universe, bane of all spacefarers. Seldom a day goes by without some new, I don't know, <laughs> nefarious, there you go, nefarious scheme occurring to this contemptible <laughs> beast. He prowls the stars uh, in his flying saucer, 
leaving naught but bitter resentment in his wake. Followers flock to him, drawn by respect or compelled by fear. At the sound of his name, his enemies scatter to the four winds. He is Dreadwing, the small blue penguin. You know what's funny? After saying his name, Dreadwig, I realized there's an N there, and it actually reads Dreadwing. <laughs> so I've been saying his name wrong this entire time. Um, like, uh, oh no, hold up, I need to back off. I'm just gonna use my mark shot, it's easier. There you go. Lastly, I can't believe I missed those. Okay, we're gonna heal just a little bit. And just start shooting them down. I mean, I don't need it to beat these people. I just do it so I can get pixels. Hold up. Okay. Uh, is there a tank here? There used to be a tank here, I think. Oh, I missed. Okay, hold up. Okay, there you go. I was like, that should hit. There you go. Alright, cool. The only problem I would say was with the mark shot is that it halts um energy replenish or like you can't gain energy when you hold um when you use it so it just like stops and you're pretty much just standing there um waiting for um for your shot i guess to happen ow should i climb this you know i'm gonna try to climb it okay maybe i shouldn't this is very dangerous oh my goodness I can't get past this first part, you're actually joking. Oh no. Heal me! Okay, cool. Let me heal again. <laughs> okay, cool. I'm just wondering what's up here. If there's like a little secret. Ow! Ow! Oh my goodness. Okay. No! It's just a wall. I'm wondering if I can shoot these. No, I can't. Okay. Oh, that's gonna- okay, I thought I was gonna take fall damage. Okay, cool. So anyways, let's go talk to the bartender at the- at the outpost. Um... After I get to the portal- just give me a second. Um... We're almost there. Uh, okay, here we are. Okay. Honestly, I don't know what the bartender is gonna sell. I guess. So I'm not sure- What's gonna happen after I talk to the bartender? Um, let's just hope he sells something good and this was all worth something. <laughs> uh, okay, let me see. Is Has this thing... No, okay. It hasn't. Oh, man. I kind of regret getting the loot. Wait. Uh, like, there's turbulence lately? Okay. Oh, they're mercenaries! Aw, oh, dude, these guys are cute. Oh, they appeared because, um, the bartender. Huh. Okay. Well, anyways, he sorted him out for me. Thanks. Now I'm back in business. Come speak to me if you want a doubloon to hire a penguin merc. What a, what's doubloon? What? <laughs> so, basically, what is this? A contract token accepted... By penguin mercenaries at the break easy b or beak easy bar or bar hold up how do you buy these oh you need diamonds yeah I can't make any or I can't buy any okay so basically now I can hire mercenaries if I wanted to what's his mission hold up oh yeah yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. That's the test drive. Anyways. Uh, so now, actually, now that I... Uh, do I... I think I have a new crewmate, right? Sorry, I'm just thinking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Off camera, I got a new crewmate. This this person. Right? Um, Is a mechanic. Which, I forgot what they do. Hold up, stop following me, guys. I'm sorry. Um, but anyways... But yeah, now I have a another mechanic. And now, since I have six crewmates, I can also get the new upgrade, 
which costs six modules, which is why I regret buying, <laughs> I regret buying, um, what do you call it? The lunar ring, since I don't even use my boomerang too much. What's this? Pillar energy? Huh? Wait, that didn't even, oh! My goodness, that scared me. <laughs> well, that takes a while to charge. Because I didn't even re let go of right click. Oh, okay, there you go. I mean that- Oh, okay, so it happens when you run out of energy. Okay. I mean, it seems good. But for now, I don't really- I don't use hammers, so I'm just gonna put it in the storage. Okay, uh, let's see. A phase blade, what? Sorry, I'm just like checking out some of the weapons that I got that I that I'm probably not even going to use. Um let's see. So anyways, uh Yeah, guys. Well, <laughs> that's kind of it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um yes, I finally beat Dreadwig. Um what I'm thinking to do next is first of all if we can probably get this i'll try to get this off camera so you guys don't need to watch me just explore around gra uh going through different areas just to get a singular module and next time i'll probably do the main mission which is to go to the hunting ground wait find the artificial uh artifact in the hunting grounds yeah i'll probably do that next which is in my missions thing yeah for all of these I pretty much just beat them all <laughs> already so I just need one more left um, to complete all the missions there but yeah well anyways guys I hope you guys enjoyed uh, leave a like and subscribe bye everyone iconic gameslinger out with my crew bye